Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. This is my friend Sophia, my first collab. Um, today we're just getting ready. We're going to this Clara concert. We're gonna do our makeup and we're gonna do like a full look. This is gonna be a chit chat get ready with me. It's not an in-depth tutorial where I'm gonna be listing everything that we're using. We're just gonna be talking and doing our own shit. So if you guys wanna see, then just keep watching and go ahead and subscribe down below and let's get this video started. Should we have brought up some topics to talk about or something? Um, well, we can just head over to Twitter and see what our fans <laughs> asked us. We can talk about the new video from Shane. Oh yeah, let's give it a review. Okay. Okay, from start to finish. Okay. What would you give it out of 10? I would say... It was like an 8 out of 10 because, yeah, in like the trailer, I like saw this like um, tease of like Morgan talking about like how she was hanging out with these like YouTubers and that they didn't even know who Jenna Marbles was. And so it's like they're not even like actual YouTubers if they don't even know who Jenna Marbles yeah. is. So I wanted to hear about that and they didn't talk about it yet. Same. I really want to see what happens when in the first trailer somebody was like banging on the door at Shane and Ryan's yeah. house. Mm. That sound in the back. <laughs> <laughs> we can talk about how we became friends. Ooh, cute. Okay. okay, so me and Sophia have been besties since we were like basically six or seven <laughs> like yeah. apparently we went to the same preschool but nobody remembers that yeah i don't yeah but we played soccer together yeah we were on the butterflies and um, the jets yeah and then we like went to the same school for like our whole lives yeah except for right now yeah, except for right now. I go to school in Sacramento. Fuck, as soon as I start the Red Islander, like, we're going in. <laughs> I wish we could listen to music. <laughs> I do get copyrighted. Um, I don't have enough... I don't like it. <laughs> I don't have enough, like, followers to, like, care about being copyrighted. Because, like, yeah. people say that when they're, like, making money. Making money yeah. And they're like, oh, like, this video's not gonna, like, make any money even if it's hella good. So like that's it's why they're worried. Yeah, but like if I wanted to just fuck around and post like a video of me smoking weed, then maybe it would be fine. Cause like the worst that happens is they like demonetize me, but I don't make money from YouTube anyways. Like it's just for fun. Mm -hmm. From watching hella YouTubers just talk about their channels and stuff, like they all say like if you like start YouTube like thinking like that you want to make money then it's not gonna like happen so like mm -hmm. I'm just doing it for fun like I'm just seeing what happens have you watched like youtubers talk about like how to start doing YouTube or anything um yeah I feel like I've just like gathered like a like overall like opinion from all the people that I like like yeah. so like I'm just running with it <laughs> I listened to the like Heath Husers vlogs mm -hmm. and they started on Vine so like that's how they got popular yeah and like they just said like it just takes like one video like where you get like lucky yeah it's like being lucky and like posting consistently enough yeah so that like you are recognized but like I feel like I got lucky with that Fenty video that got like a good amount of views yeah like that like, was the lucky one for me if you are like reviewing stuff as it comes out because like yeah as soon as the jawbreaker palette came out i was like looking at tutorials with it so yeah that's what i'm trying to do for like these launches right now because like it would be hella expensive if i try to buy everything that came out because like it's yeah it's old news after that yeah that's true so that's why i'm like i feel like i'll actually enjoy these palettes that are coming out right now like with shane and manny yeah. Oh yeah, I didn't say what I was using. <laughs> I'm using this Fenty Uncensored um, liquid lipstick for my eyeliner because I bought this ColourPop one and this video probably would have already been up by now, 
but I bought this ColourPop um, red eyeliner and it's honestly not as good as I thought it was going to be. Like, we're, I'm still going to work with it, like we'll see, but I just feel like this was a little more reliable for me to put on for this concert. But we'll use both. Yeah. <laughs> Show them what you're using. With the ColourPop Yes Please palette in the Ooh, shade. she's used and abused. Bling. Yeah, you could say that again. And I'm just gonna set my eyes. <laughs> I'm just taking a br clean brush and smoking out all the pigment into the crease. I haven't put anything in my crease yet. What blush are you gonna wear? Um, I always wear this one. It's just it's my best. Oh, nice. It's Bobbi Brown in the shade Nectar. Nectar Collector. Mm hmm You could use one of mine if you want. Okay. Do you have a lot? Yeah, I have a lot. I'm just gonna blend this, like, all the way over here. We can fun. make a wing out of it. Now that I set my eyes with this pink color, big cocktails and bling mixed together, these two, I'm gonna take this maroon red color in butter cake. I'm using this NYX Ultimate palette. It's all the rainbow shades you need from the drugstore. Um, not to shade James Charles, but you don't need to go by however much that is when this is like at your nearest target. The pigment is there. I'm gonna just put this in my outer corner and then blend it in eventually. Pre-gaming by six. Yeah, we're leaving pre by seven. at six. We're leaving at seven, because doors open at seven. Mm -hmm. Wow, that is a really potent. Well, back to the Jeffree Star real yeah. quick. The new Shane video, I really liked the top two lines of colors, like the browns mm -hmm. that were in one line and then it was like more colors that I would use every day. And yeah. then those blues, I wasn't loving the blues. And the food yeah. video color, that like puke yellow, I wasn't living for that color. Yeah. I'm glad that they I'm glad that they took one of the brown shades and put it in the mini palette. Like if they're still doing that. Yeah. Cause like they can't have two crease shades. Yeah. But the only thing I was thinking is like low-key tea the only thing i was thinking mm -hmm. is like is there a crease shade for like a brown girl like the crease shade was like really like light yeah it was like like basically like this color yeah. or something okay let's see where it comes from so like they wouldn't like get any use of out of that color yeah. unless it was for like like a matte highlight yeah <laughs> but, like nobody like does a... that anymore yeah so just a little thought food for thought yeah I'm gonna go in with Louis, this color, and um, blend out the red. I'm using this Marc Jacobs eyeliner. I got it with my Beauty Insider points, so it was free. <laughs> Shameless plug. Some of them are like so copyrighted that you can't use it at all, and then some of them like you can actually use it mm -hmm. that's why how I used like did you see my video um, you saw the color pop video right which one the unboxing with the um the soul yeah yeah so. like um, I used the song nights in that song in that video oh yeah actually I did notice that and I was like huh. <laughs> 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 yeah. Macy got this for me for my birthday. That's hella cute. Yeah, I like feel like That's I wouldn't have bought it for myself, so yeah. it's hella cute. I used black eyeliner to like get down this shape and then I'm using this shade to just go over it. So now I'm gonna put some yellow in the middle, but I'm using this color French Kiss. If you guys haven't seen my story time video, the first one I made, um, Sophia was in a lot of the stories. She was in the story about mm -hmm. how a car was literally driving towards us. Yeah. About to run us over. It's still the craziest day of my life. My but life flashed before my eyes. <clears throat> that would be funny if my eyelids just stayed red for like ever. 
and you're stained as do you try not to cuss in your videos? Nah, I don't care. I feel like I don't know if I'm gonna put this in, but a lot of people like cuss and then they stop because they get like a brand to sponsor them and the brand doesn't want them to. Mm -hmm. But I'm like Jeffrey can curse and he has Morphe. I'm gonna do what he does. <laughs> yeah. I'm gonna I'm just gonna follow his path and maybe I'll be a Louis Vuitton bitch one day. Maybe you don't do everything he does. No, not everything. I guess following his business brand style, because I feel like that is like pretty good. Yeah. Maybe I not think... all his like tea and stuff like that. Yeah. I feel like you can't argue that he doesn't have good formulas and like packaging at least. Yeah. I'm going back in with the same red color and just making it pop on the outside. For this glitter, I'm using this Kathleen Lights The Ram pigment from ColourPop. And I also use the NYX glitter primer under it. The ColourPop makes you like think Sophia Nygaard is emailing you. <laughs> I wish. Did you see her video about the giant lipstick? No, actually. <gasps> oh my god, I can't believe you haven't seen it. Did she just make a giant lipstick? Yeah. <laughs> and then she puts her face on it. And then literally everyone in the video kisses the lipstick after. To like get it on their lips. Yeah. Some pretty fire application. Is it, is it a good color? Yeah, it was like, um, she made the berry shade. Mm. Berry me and berries, maybe. Mm -hmm. So she like recreated it in a larger thing. I would 10 out of 10 go back to that Mexican place. It was good. It tasted good, but the tortilla was, yeah, like falling apart. No like wonder it was cheaper. Hmm. I don't know if I should like add more depth. I think I'm gonna add more depth because I have hooded eyes. I don't want to look like a whack job in these photos. <laughs> so I took some of this Fenty Beauty. This is Erica's, but Mademoiselle. Mademoiselle. This, this pink color. I'm gonna put some of that on my inner corner and see how it works. Do you like doing your face or eyes better? Um, probably eyes. Yeah. But sometimes I feel like I look better if I just do like natural just yeah. face and like natural eyeshadow, but like I enjoy doing really colorful yeah, shit with like lashes. And... Everyone comment in the comments below, do you like doing your face or eyes better? I like watching people do their face, I think. Or I like watching Nikki tutorials do her face, cause like... Cause she, she fucking snatches the shit out of her Yeah, face. she puts hella foundation on. <laughs> she really just goes there. I'm gonna just try and fix it with this. I'm gonna put this in the inner corner. This Stila liquid lipstick, I think. Wait, no, is it a liquid eyeshadow? Yeah, it's a liquid eyeshadow. Into Here, do you want to try corner. this one thing in your inner corner? I just wanted to try and use it. Okay. <laughs> Hella passive aggressive. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, already. <laughs> I'm like, already for the first time. Okay, I'm gonna take this same little Sephora brush and just like tap that in. Are those the ones that Dalton got you? Yeah, actually. Nice. They look like a charm. Shout out to Dalton. <laughs> <clears throat> Pop Super Shock Cheek Flexitarian Color. Were you anything for Halloween last year? I don't even remember <laughs> what you did. <laughs> like what I did for Halloween. I think it was on a Wednesday. Did you dress up? Probably not. <laughs> I feel like there wasn't like a party. Yeah. Okay, I was gonna use Kathleen Light's Dream Street. I was gonna wear the milk primer. Like, if I'm being completely honest, sometimes it looks fire and sometimes it doesn't. Does it, like, mess with the way your foundation looks sometimes? Like, I don't even- I didn't use it in the last video that I made, but sometimes it clumps up weirdly, like, around, like, my, like, nose and stuff, and, like, it yeah. makes- the foundation separate so I think I'm just gonna use my Becca one so I know like nothing's gonna happen. I don't have good 
habits with my brushes, I feel like. I like use the same brush for like five different colors at once, but it happens, it happens. It happens I feel like if you pick up like one here and there from e.l.f., mm -hmm. like eventually you'll have a full collection. Just like, like if you, it's sometimes hard for me to remember like, oh, I need to pick up this. Yeah. But if you remember like what kind of brush you need, like e.l.f. has basically all of them. Yeah, I have like, a list of different brushes that I want to get for different things. Like, what do you have to get? Like, I want a pointy brush that's, like, fluffy but, like, has a pointed tip. One of those, like, skinny ones to, like, put inner corner stuff. Yeah. And I want, like, a big brush, like this one. Yeah. But, like, a huge one to wipe off my powder or yeah. mix, whatever. That one looks hella good. I feel like it looks good in pictures too. Which one? This. Oh, the position's for me. Yeah. Yeah. I feel like it's a little light, but. Yeah, mine like... is light too, because the color selection is weird. Yeah. Like in the store too, when you have to do it. Yeah. So <laughs> now when it. I go, I'm gonna get the one darker. <laughs> we are primed. I use the Becca Backlight Priming. Oh, fuck. I always say backlight priming filter. I'm using the Becca first light priming filter. But I'm just triggered because last time um, one of my earrings almost fell off, but I caught it. But it's not going to be that wild in there. Yeah. It's Claro, not Can I get the disco. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I don't even know. <laughs> oh, God. You just defended so many fans. I know. On my laptop, I can, like, go to all my videos and, like, see, like, comments and, like, like how people, like, like what got them to click on the video and a lot of them say or for like my most popular one it just says google search or like youtube search so people just look looked up your name yeah or maybe they looked up like the product now that i'm thinking about it and they were like oh like i want to see the fenty palette you need to try the jouet concealer it's like a really good concealer but it doesn't like dry me out so that like my under eyes look like old ladies at the end of the day yeah can i use your spray yeah nice <clears throat> well i have i have like a more pink lipstick this bare i have some bare minerals ones that are like really creamy nice what powder oh cover fx oh is yeah that, is that like what is it like? I'm trying to think if it's this one. <clears throat> I asked, it's just like a translucent powder. She, I said, can I um, get something that's good for on setting your under eyes without flashback? And she was like, oh, you need this. And then I bought the mini one. <laughs> nice, nice. She said you need the full size one. I feel like that they're actually helping <clears throat> and it's like this would be the actual best product, but then I'm just too cheap to like. Yeah. Well, everybody has their own, like, prices, too. Hello, bronzer. Oh, cool. It comes with the, like, the, um, oh, shit. Yeah, it comes with the, uh, minted mojito and sand castle. Fenty Which one do you, highlighter. do you mix them, or, like, what? <coughs> it depends on, like, the tones of my eyeshadow, or, like, mm -hmm. what I'm doing. But I feel like I would go with this rosy one today. I just remembered when I was at the ASAP concert. <laughs> I think I saw like a guy there with with AirPods on. <laughs> That's so stupid. Those tickets were probably so expensive. I know. I'm gonna go and wear AirPods. Mm, that has like a shimmer. I like that. I need like an in-depth, like close photo of my eyeshadow because like I feel like far away I won't do it justice.
Okay guys, we're back to do the lip and um, close out this video. I think you should use um, the Fenty like thing. Where'd it go? This. The Mademoiselle. Okay. And then like, you should do like a neon lip because like, you yeah, I know. go out of your that. comfort zone. Yeah. I'm gonna do like a more dark nude. I'm gonna use this just to line my lips because I just want the focus to be on the eyeshadow. And I'm already wearing cheetah print, which is like kind of distracting too. So I just want to wear like a cute, glossy, nude lip. gloss I'm gonna use the ColourPop So Juicy lip gloss super pink Ooh, cute. so opposite lip colors but it's <laughs> so cute I also put on the soul body or we both did actually she put on a lot more <laughs> <laughs> yeah. The sun is setting at the perfect time because we are done with this video, guys. We finished our lip. This is our full look. Um, I'll probably insert some clips from the concert. Um, this is how my eyeshadow turned out. I ended up using the like Euphoria little gems, and I really like how it turned out. This is Fia's makeup. A little sunset moment. She also used the gems too. So yeah. yeah, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please give a <laughs> like if you like collabs and you want me to do more. And also subscribe down below and comment your favorite part about this video. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye guys.